Welcome back to Is It Playable? In this video, we'll be taking a look at whether Grand Theft Auto San Andreas is playable with BTSX2 within RetroArch. Yet again, this is another game I have tested in my own time, and it's not bad, but um, it, it performs at full speed, I, I'm pretty sure, if memory serves. The downside is there is constant ghosting, which you'll soon see when the game actually boots. Although I do remember the game takes a while to get into it. Yeah, it's just one of those sad things. It, it affects, I'm pretty sure, both the cutscenes and the gameplay. Yeah. It's not that obvious, I guess, but it's definitely there. Oh my god, memories. <laughs> I mean, I've played San Andreas since, but yeah, it's been a while. To be fair, the ghosting I've encountered in this is similar to ghosting I've encountered in Resident Evil 4 when upscaling the resolution. But this seems to occur regardless. Alright, let's go! International Airport, Liberty City. Is there ghosting in the cutscenes? Oh yeah, there we go. You can see there's ghosting. Like there's two CJs. One of them's slightly larger than the other. Can I not skip this? Okay, good. But the game's perfectly fine. Again, from what I remember. You'll just notice that, yeah, everything's... Like, there's like a double of everything. I can't actually tell where... Like, what exactly is being ghosted? Oh yeah, I can. Essentially, it's that palm tree in the top left. And the tree next to it. That you can see that. So it's essentially whatever's in your viewpoint is what's being ghosted. But to be fair, you can only really tell when you look at the sky or toward the skybox. I'm also just realising I'm going the wrong way. I mean, it... You can see it everywhere, but it's not incredibly obvious. So if that's something you'd be able to actually kind of like tune out, then you would definitely be able to, you know, the game's definitely playable. But I will admit, I've not actually gotten to like, combat or anything. Like none of the shooting or stuff. That's why you bunny hop. I just remember having a, f a grand old time with the cheats. Like having the like, moon, moon bunny hop. And all that stuff. Okay. Big smoke. It's just one of those minor inconveniences, I guess. It's much worse than the cutscenes. It's much more obvious. I suppose it tends it depends on the colour of stuff. Like because the walls are like blue and white, it sticks out more. But when you're out and about, it's not super obvious, because everything sort of blends together. Hmm. You wanna drive? Oh yeah, I don't actually drive anywhere. If I can get to a point where I'm getting shot at, then, you know. It'll all be good. Definitely don't think I'll be getting to a point where I shoot, because... It takes a, wh a while to get to. I mean, we have to escape first. Which is what- this is one of those missions that can go either way. Sometimes it goes perfectly fine and other times they seem to just focus on you and then you get screwed. As a result. They do not move very fast. Oh god. I don't know where we go. Ah! Yeah, <laughs> suckers. Just, just follow Ryder, I guess. Ah! No! This is what I mean, it can really screw you over. Oh, there they go. Thankfully, they got stuck. Ha! Ah, suckers. You're too far away, stay with sweet. I would if I didn't get knocked off the bloody bike. There we go, cutscene. Whew! Close. That's what I mean, this mission can go one of two ways. You either get knocked off the bike and screwed, or you're fine. Whoa, dear. 
Oh no, we follow Ryder. Let's go! Downside is I, I have to follow him, I can't just... Can't just go on my own way. Why you bother coming back? Hey, my cycling skill upgraded. I remember this. Oh god. <laughs> I can put hop higher. What happened to smoke? <laughs> he crashed into a wall. The idiot. What a fool. Oh god, I can tell them behind me. I can hear the car. How do I look behind me? Ah, R2 and L2. Maybe they're not behind me. I thought they were. I nearly took Ryder out then. Oh, can I do this? Yeah, yeah. Nice. I remember where we go. I'm pretty sure. We go up here. And then we're basically around a corner. I should probably not go too far ahead because we know what, what Rockstar ga games are like when it comes to failing you. Excuse you? There we go, we're fine. Did Ryder really just cra- Oh, he made it- he made it through. It's all good. If I get just a tiny bit too far ahead, the game will fail me. They are- <laughs> They're closing in! Excuse you, you're too far away. Are you kidding? Well, Ryder should speed up then. There he is. I'm ahead of you! Jackass. Hell yeah! Made it. Whew! I got with them motherfuckers though. Sold them niggas who's gangster. Ride a nigga. I can't skip this. Oh, there we go. Respect. I would try and do the cheats, but I don't remember any of them. <laughs> Come inside, CJ's house to continue. Do I have to? Oh, because the game wants me to save. Hey, I lost some fat. But yeah, the game's perfect in terms of, like, performance. It's just a minor inconvenience having everything ghosted, but you can learn to live with it. For sure. Oh, actually, if I go upstairs, isn't there a camera? I remember there being so many, like, rumours about this game. There is a camera! Yeah, about there being, like, a ghost. Whether that actually exists or not, I don't remember. But I remember hearing about it when I was a lot younger. How do I aim? I don't remember. Oh, I press R1. And then X. Square. Ooh. Circle. Ah, oh, yes, of course. Well, there we go. Oh, God. I don't know if it wants me to save. I hope not. Because I don't want to. Hmm. Oh, go see Radder. He lives down the street. Hooray! But I think I'll do. L1. What? CJ. What's up? Hello? Hey, thought I'd explain some shit. Sweet, hey. Yeah, skip the call. I don't care. So, I don't remember how I do anything. Oh, there we go. Yeah, I can punch people. Bitch. It's R1 to lock on. God, I keep thinking it's L1 for some reason. Yeah. Nice. The true Grand Theft Auto experience. Just beating the shit out of somebody. What is this? Uh, okay. Yeah, I remember the game tells you all this stuff. Well, there we go. Yeah, I would have to say that Grand Theft Auto San Andreas is playable with issues. Obviously, because everything is ghosted, but... As I say, you can live with it. It is weird what it chooses to ghost, though. Because that's the White House directly ahead. Yeah, in the bottom right, it's the White House straight ahead. Now it's Sweet's house. I can't really tell. I think that's... Yeah, you can see the roof of CJ's house. Weird. But yeah, Grand Theft Auto San Andreas is playable with issues, and that's going to be the end of this video. Thank you so much for watching, I hope you've enjoyed. If you did, please like the video, subscribe for more, leave suggestions for games you want to see, and until next time, take care.